This is Marion Roland. Yesterday in the downhill, a shocker to everyone, second place for this French skier. Unbelievable. She ran early, took advantage of the good snow. She's running early again today, so she knows exactly what to do. But we were surprised at how well she was able to arc those skis on the turns because she can go straight a whole lot better than she can on edge. And more of an advantage to go early in the Super G than the downhill. So another good sign for Roland. The tighter the turn, like they are in Super G, you're going to use more edge, you're going to put more pressure, and you're going to dig farther into that snow, creating bigger and bigger ruts. Here's this awesome traverse. The snow's a little dirty. It's been a little bit warm, and you got to ride it high up and over that awesome terrain. And if there's a crown there, and there's a great view of it. You do not see where you're going until you crest that little area there, and roll on is rolling on. She skied very well into that middle section, carried speed across that traverse. And look at her, just online, very calm, awesome. Yes, indeed. Wow. Tessa Worley, not known as a Super G skier, great giant stall skier, yesterday in the downhill was 12th, so her speed quite good. For Roland to be that far ahead of her teammate Worley is a very good sign. You know, not to discount it, but uh, you know, sometimes you find a pair of skis, and there she is letting that line go really low. You find a pair of skis that works in certain snow, maybe she's just gonna hang on to them. And a little bit of dirt. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, y'all.